Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video that's going to give you guys some great cleaning motivation. I also have a little DIY project that I'm working on in my daughter's room that I wanted to show you guys. It's super simple and I will leave the links below for all of the supplies that you'll need for it. Final story is death and glory And tomorrow the sun will rise and we'll start over again I started out by tidying um, my room and just dusting things down Getting just everything kind of looking a little more organized I love to start my day off this way And I feel like I'm so much more productive whenever I get my bed made Okay, I am going to do some decor in here today. If you guys watch my vlog channel, you know I've been talking about this, kind of collecting things and whatnot. I just got this duvet cover for them, um, and I will link all this stuff below because all of it is pretty much from Amazon. But I have some throw pillows, throw pillow covers to put on. I've got a little thing I'm gonna put together here after a bit. But the first thing I'm gonna do is probably make the bed. And um, I need to put a coat of paint on this shelf right here. You guys can see like there was holes that were filled in and everything. So it needs a coat of paint on it and it's a little chippy. And I'll just let you watch as I work. These pillow forms and pillow covers are both from Amazon and honestly I think I'm going to be reordering these pillow forms. They were excellent especially for the price and I think they were 20 by 20. They were pretty good size and the girls actually picked out the pillow covers. questions all the time on what white paint I use since I use so much white paint and it's the hard hide white from Valspar at Lowe's that's my go-to I just think it's so bright and actually the lady at Lowe's whenever I first bought it my first can of it a long time ago told me that they actually put a couple drops of black in it and so I think it helps it kind of lean more towards the grays and not so yellow looking but either way i really love the color okay so now i'm going to take these hoops and they are from amazon they come in come in packs of two like this i think they're like 14 or 16 inches something like that but they're just this light metal um and i'm going to hang them up with little like decorative command strips but I have all this floral stuff that I had used in their room before. I'm going to pull it out. I've got some wire and some wire cutters to add to these hoops. And then I'm going to put them up there above the bed. One step closer to
wire to attach everything to the hoops and it was a little challenging to get them positioned where I wanted them to be but I used some tape and just kind of grabbed things from around the house that I could use to secure them in place. Okay, these are the little decorative command strips I'm gonna be using and it's probably going to take, I don't know, three or four per hoop. They fit in here perfectly. So you'll probably be able to slightly see them, but not really. Um, and it'll keep my hoop in whatever position I want it to be. Because obviously right now, if I hung it on one nail, it would always go down, the flowers would always go down to the bottom, but to keep them in position, these will work perfect. I had a couple times that the hoops fell down. I had to find the exact position for the command strips <laughs> for them to stay up because it was overlapping. And since they were overlapping, um, some of them pulled in different directions. But I finally got it figured out and found the best way for them. So this was actually um, the next day and I'm in my other daughter's room and I just wanted to get everything straightened up. I love Betty's bedding um, for bunk bed style beds, which this one is kind of like that. It just makes it so quick and easy to make up the bed. Also, I did have the girls pick up all of their toys before I started in on cleaning this day. So yes, we have toys, and yes, they get everywhere, but um, they are to the age where they do really well at picking up their own toys and putting them where they belong. And with any good cleaning day, of course, a load of laundry was involved. So I just went ahead and got that started. And then I had a lot to fold. I'm really good at getting my laundry through right now, but getting it all folded up um, is a little bit more of a challenge for me. So there you go. You got some good laundry folding motivation.
the living room wasn't too bad this day, but I wanted it to just kind of get a little bit more orderly. So I folded the blankets and picked up the pillows and back. The dishes I tackled next, and I love my dishwasher. I love running it pretty often. <laughs> and also, I wanted to mention, you can see them sitting on the counter there. I picked them up off of the table, but we have been using some silicone placemats from Amazon for the girls, and they are so convenient. They clean up so well, and I believe you can actually put them in your dishwasher. I just wipe them down, but they've been great at helping to cut down on messes because they do have a little lip around the edge of them. So if the girls dump something, the placemat kind of catches it all for me and it's super convenient. So they come in packs of three and I will leave a link below. Stepped into my life, such a magic feeling. We tore down my walls. I wish I could go back to right before you told me I try to change it all. But look at us now, we could have gone so far. It hurts to realize we're parted. Yeah, look at us now, this is who we are. And I just know things will never be the same We're like strangers again, again, again Strangers again, again, again We're like strangers again, again, again I just know things will never be the same We're like strangers again Tried much harder, all we have are scars. You said we'd get so high, higher up than heaven. You said we'd reach the stars. But look at us now, we could have gone so far. It hurts to realize we're parted. And yeah, look at us now, this is who we are. And I just know. Thank you guys so much for watching today. I hope this video gave you a ton of motivation and I'm going to have a lot of new content coming up on this channel. I'm really excited um, to share with you. Don't forget to give this video a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in my next video.